Hello guys, welcome back to Techwood Jacks. I am back with another video. So in this video, we are going to see learn about material design. What is material design library? What are the principle of material design? And also we are going to create a simple date picker dialog, which is not a simple one, which is the material date picker dialog. So before starting this video, first of all, I want to introduce if you don't know what is material library. So material is a principle or we can say some design guidelines which should we follow in our Android projects which help to create a constant design in an entire project. So material providers lots of components like button, text use, progress bars, date picker, time pickers and lots of other things. So if you want to read about more on material design then you can go on material design website. So if I am typing here material design so you can see this is the website where you can learn lots of things. So we are going to create a only a date picker dialog in this video but you can also learn lots of things and it contain an entire principle how to select color in your apps how to select how to create beautiful apps and how to create constant design in throughout the apps so before now let's see a demo what we are actually going to make in our project so for this i have to open my phone so you can see i open this application it contain a button and a text view so if i click on this button pick date so you can see it is showing me date picker dialog so now you can select any date it is your choice it also contain lots of things so I give the on title the select date but you can give any date it is your choice now you can customly select a year from here it is your choice you can also scroll between calendar and also if you want to type the date manually then you can also click on this pencil icon and it also contain validation so let us suppose if you type any not wrong date it automatically contain any validation so you need to type a correct date so this is the benefit of using material design in your project so you can see it contains lots of feature and we have to just write only a simple line of code only two or three lines and we can use this entire features so now let's select any date so for this i am just picking here 12 12 jan 2022 and if i click on ok so you can see on the text view the date is showing here so if i select different date you can see now it is showing here so we are going to create this same thing in today's video so don't further delay now let's start the video and if you don't like the video till now then please like the video and if you don't subscribe the channel then please subscribe the channel so now let's start the video so for this open your android studio and after opening your android studio go to file new new project and you can also implement in your previous project it is your choice and i am just typing here material date and you can use any language it is also just click on finish so project will successful so now let's open your xml file and here we need to write the code so first of all we will we create a just simple layout and then we will write the main code how we are going to show that thing so for this first of all i am just changing here to constraint layout to little layout and for using material components we need a dependency which is material dependency so if i open this project you can see in latest Android Studio, by default, this dependency is already added. But if you have a previous version or older version of Android Studio, then maybe you need to add this dependency. So make sure you have this dependency if you want to use material components in your project. Now inside this, what I need, I need a simple button. So I am just typing, I am going to use a material button here. So material button and match parent wrap content. And just giving a text here. So text, pick date. And then I am just giving an ID. So ID, BT, pick date. So this is a button that's why I add a suffix here, prefix here bt. Now let's give a margin here, so margin 200 dB it is fine and center in parent pass through. So 200 dB is I think very large so let's go with 100 dB. So you can see it is fine now. Now what we need, we need a text view to show the date also which we picked. So material text view we can go with material text view, match parent app content and uh, just give it uh, any id so tv date and uh, we can set any hint so date displays here and text size so I am giving the text size 20 sp and uh, we can give also a padding 5 dp text alignment center and layout our pick and uh, it is not working because we give a margin here so we need to replace it by margin start and margin and so you can see now it is fine so now open your activity main dot java or kt and here we need to write the code main code how we will going to show the date picker dialog so first of all let's assign the xml id to java id so what we have we have a two things material text tree. so i am giving here tv date and material button so now assign the xml id to java id so tv date equal find view id r dot id dot 
tv date and bt pick date equal find view id r dot id dot so you can see now if someone click on bt pick date button then we have to show the dialog bt pick date or set on click less new then capital one press enter and here we need to show the date picker dialog show date picker dialog and now let's create this function and here we have to write the main code how we are going to show our material date picker dialog so it is always better you can also show your date picker dialog after this but it is always better to create a separate function for every component so it will also help to create a reusable code and you should also focus on quality of the code if you are writing a or if you want to learn android clearly more in depth then you should also focus on the readability and the clarity of the code so now inside this what do you need we need a just a material date picker declare a variable of this material date picker equal then now we just type here material date picker we need to build here builder dot date picker you need you can also build a custom date picker it also contain a date range picker so you can select between two ranges of dates so it contain lots of thing you can explore on their website now after this it is showing error because we need to set the title as well so dots set you can also set a custom theme which can show the diamond on your selected date and lots of thing so just now i am setting here set title text so you can select any text so i am just typing here select date you can give any custom message according to your own application and at last what we need we need to build this then i am give here material date picker so i need to show here this one dialog so material date picker dot show inside this if you want to show inside the fragment manager you just need to type here get support fragment manager if you are also showing inside the activity then you also need to type here get support fragment manager and any message so you can type here any tag message it is just for checking for the error purpose that's why we need to just give here any error message so i just type here tag now what happen if you someone click on date then how to show that date on our text view so for this we need to also set an on click listener to our okay button so material date picker contain four type of button let us suppose you click on cancel you dismiss the dialog you can click on okay and other thing so i am just going to set here on positive listener but you can also set on negative listener you can see it contain four things on dismiss on cancel on positive and on negative you can perform different thing according to your requirements but we are going to set only on on positive if user click on okay then we need to show the date which is selected by the user on our text view so add on positive listener then new then press enter so after this just add a semicolon here so now we need to show the date on our text view so i just typing here tv date dot set text and i need to type here and from where i will get the date from my material date picker so i will type here material date picker dot get header text so whenever you select any date in material date picker it automatically show that date on our header so we just need to get that text and we have to show that text on our text view so hope you understand how this code is working so now let's run our app and see whether it is working or fine or not and if it is working fine then we will end this video so i connect my phone and it will start building so let's wait for a gradle build and so you can see application installed successfully now let's click on this and you can see it is showing the dialog so let us suppose i select any date you can see the date is selected date is visible on header so if i click on okay you can see it is visible on our text view so our application is working fine so i hope guys you learned something new in this video if you have any question if you have any query just comment down below i will try to give the answer of every comment please like the video please subscribe to the channel please share the channel we are going to upload lots of projects in future so please just support our channel so please like the video please subscribe and please share so thank you guys see you soon in next amazing video thank you